Get underway for our 1.40 p.m. game between Faith Lutheran College from Plainlands. And they'll take on St. James College from, from Brisbane. Faith College coached by Barry Cronin. While St. James is Andrew Ebrington. Who goes off for everyone to get started? St. James is going to kick off from the southern end. And Faiths will bring it back. Ball will go dead in goal. That'll be a line drop out of here, I think, for, uh, for Faith Lutheran. Kick on a string. Short kickoff pays off. No. So, penalty saying he was took it just inside the 10 metre line. So, here's a chance here for St. James to put an unusual try if they get one on the board. First up, well, they do do that. Charges through. Tap restart. And St. James come up with a try with an extraordinary start to this game. I've been the Elijah Ewing. This is the number 13. Nobody else wanted it. He said, I'll take it. And boom, over he goes the beginner. 4 0 underneath the crossbar. Let's wait for this conversion. Conversion successful, 6 0. Two minutes gone, so kick off went dead in goal. So it was a line drop out, a short one, didn't go 10 metres, so therefore it was a penalty. And then he got a try, oh, sorry, a tap restart. And Elijah Kuhn smashed though, pretty soft in the end. So that hasn't woken up Faith Lutheran College, nothing will. Shortage kick off this time, that goes 10 metres. Bounces back, bounces back, so they come up with a footy now to Faith. Knock on! Oh, I thought that might have been a hit. Now, this is a knock on after the strip from the St. James's player. Seem to be decked out to the backs of plane lands have come up with the errors of St. James. We'll get the scrum feed on the 40. Another one. It's a flat line. There you go. Completely confusing me. Not hard. Good tackle for there from Cordingly. Lock forward going sideways is Cronin. That's the 30. Go that blind side. It's a half back there and Kyle Corden. Good tackle. Super one around the ball carrier. Dislodges the footy and a good shot there from Oliver Chambers. Or, or Chalmers, I should say. Scrum feed to St. James's this time. That leads 6 0 after a crazy try in the first two minutes. Mouse trappish goes back out the other way. Half a dummy, a break. The defence has to come over to Rissi. Puts a tackle on with some help from Brody Hicks. One out stuff here from St. James. It's trying to get some field position for a kick at the back end. 
halfway line, still in front, falls over, Sniper gets him. Still going, still going the big unit. And that's Alam Nan, still going, gets the offload. Oh, is this another crazy try here from St. James's? <coughs> Teresi Amali Ala. Alam Nah, that's him with the ball again. Hasn't had enough, the big fella. Now it's the last. 20 metres out from the try line. Try score. Puts it on the toe. There's cooing. I'll run it back into the field of play. So. Well, a bit of carnage in the middle. It's just all happening here in this clash between Faith Lutheran College from Plainlands. Between Brisbane and Toowoomba. Oh, has a look. And if you want to know what disappointment looks like, check out the face on Riley Glass after he drops that one. Cannot believe it. Straightforward pass. Nothing doing. Just nerves. A little adrenaline. Have a look at this. Just drops it cold. Set play here. They, I think they're missing it. Yeah, here we go. I think they had enough in the scrum. It seemed like they had eight in the back line. Half back wave that pop pass back to a back rower, and that band is Togia. Short like ball, like trying to get yeah, across the line. The big the fella goes for a shot, and Levi Quok. Without Held up. So he'll go back to the 10 metre mark. Here he goes again. Queuing, queuing, queuing. Gets a double, the big fellow. Well, he doesn't like to pass the footy. Why should he? Comes up with a second try. Got one in the second. Now he's got one in the seventh. Margin media. Batch mewing lawyers. Brisbane Ice. The replay out. Workforce. Nothing doing there. Pineland found his way Greenland. through there. And Mitch the player tries to snatch the ball rather than make the tackle. Thanks very much for all those. He's hanging uh, on to that for all money. Elijah Kewing. Explosive start here from the. Changes from Brisbane. For no players from Plainlands. They won't take this lying down. Strong bodies. Read them big out there in the, the Lockyer. Strikes it. Oh, probably want to have that one again. Score remains 10 0. Yeah, probably didn't number up too far apart. Probably because they had quite a few numbers to the left-hand side. The defence didn't know who was going to get the footy, but I'm thinking next time, just go straight for 13. He ain't passing it. So if you're uh, watching around Brisbane and you're not here today, get down here tomorrow. Wednesday's a rest day. Thursday and Friday, semi finals and finals. Shortish kickoff. This one goes 20 metres. Loses the footy. That's a good shot there from Teresi. Knocks the ball out of Button Wright's carry. And they'll get a scrum feed here on the 30. Scrum one. Kick on the first. Here's a chance here. Half asleep. Picks it up on the half volley. Gets close. Oh, I thought for sure there was a try. Penalty. Somebody asking somebody to go to the bin for 10. Probably want to be careful. He might be the one who goes. The referee's got a fair idea. It's going to be a 
Kentley right in front. Plain lens looking to cash in. The winger. The winger will stand, plays it. The number 13, he wants to have a crack here, this time from Faith. Another penalty. So Cronin. Take a tap restart. We're sure there's a way through this forward pack here from St. James's for Faith. Are they going to go that way again? Once again, Tubbo Nguyenya. Denied. Dummy half run here, but they're away to that one. Good defence here. Led by Belaine Pua. Defence here from St. James is too good. No way through here for Faith. Now they've got a sweeping play. That's better play. That's better play. They get a try here. And over he goes. Lachlan Ralston. And Ralston will get four back. They tried to bash through the middle, but now they have a sweeping play out to the right. You see the two head, well, three headgears come into play. The middle one scores, and it's right in front as well. So this could be a four-point ball game. I want to put a kiss of death on the goal kicker. Field one will be between Aquinas, Aquinas College against All Souls St. Gabriel's. Set to kick off at 2.30. Strikes it successfully. 10 points to six now. So game on. Let's have a look at this. You'll see three headgears coming to play. So James has got to pick which one's going to have the footy. Could have been a cutout ball to the one that went to the right instead of finds the middle one and, and that one being Lachlan Ralston. Restart, they touched, everybody's on. Runs it out from his own in goal area. That might actually be the try scorer in Ralston. <laughs> Ran it back into the biggest guy on the planet. Tackle there was queuing, been involved in everything. Catch and pass stuff to the left. Now the lock forward. A redhead of that Cronin. Gets shoveled back. He got over halfway, but he's lost two back inside his own territory. Kicking early. Sure the outside men knew about this kick, but end over end. Two metres out from his own line. The fullback will bring it back accordingly. Accordingly. Oh, just almost got out of that tackle, but just lost balance. Williams Burns around the, around the legs with help there from Colrain now yeah, another big body Vaka Lahi take him on he's been told to take him on and he does so and he gets a lot of meters thinks about the offload there there's a try score on queuing gets up quick play the ball pull it back now Vaka Lahi Gets within 22. Last tackle, says the referee. Puts it on the toes. There's Chalmers to the right. That's come off a, uh, a faith player. That should be a scrum or a feed to St. James. Unless he's out. It's a long way away from where I am. Yeah, it will be. Six more here for St. James. So the last thing after scoring a try... Playlands is to concede one back straight away. Q 
queuing again. Gets a pass from Chalmers. Short ball, they'll go over and score a try here, and this is Levi Kwok. Gets a pass from Button right, and easy as you like, goes over and scores to the right of the uprights. We have a look here. Just a short ball, finds a big number 10, and he's not going to pass it either. Levi Kwok. Levi Kwok asks if he wants to have a break. Well, good luck. He wants another one. Four minutes, Jimmy. Four minutes. Let's go. Four and a half minutes. Well, it'll be four minutes by the time. At least four. By the time this kick's done and dusted. This one up and well, he's not having a good day, the kicker. Big man on little man, he'll always win that one. They go the short kickoff. I need to. Uh, 14 points to six. Three and a half to go. They want to kick it deep and keep them down there and then reset for the second half. Here he comes. Gets the offload as well. Look out. St. James's. They're thundering up the middle of the park. Kieran turns the ball back inside. Coleman picks it up. It's all on the back of the carry, I think, for the try scorer and Levi Kwok. He's asked whether he wanted to come off, and for that reason, he said no, and bang. Two forty to Gear gets the offload. It's like they're behind by fifty points here, St James's. Again, we'll carry there from the 14 and Alam Nah. Still going, the big fella wants another one, Quark. Eight short, they're lining up. Plainlands hanging on. Faith Lutheran College from Plainlands there, under the pump from St. James. One meter out. Puts a kick into the corner, takes it, loses it. That'll be a changeover. One and a half minutes to go for this first half. Well, here's a break. Kicks it. Away goes Hurtick. Looking for a bounce, it's still alive, comes off the boot. That's going to say it's a knock on by St. James's, but scrum feet here to Faith Lutheran. One minute and ten to go, whether they get, get a full set. Fourteen six. Through the hands with Nelson. Nelson gives it off to Walters, who'll take the tackle. 39 metres out. Dummy half is Beaven. Now with Nielsen who loses the footy. Play on, says the referee, so they'll run the clock down or they'll run it down underneath the goalpost, maybe. Here he goes with another run there, is with Coleman. And Coleman gets to the 40 metre line. Still going as Coleman. Gets to the 30. Toloi, dummy half. 
throws more dummies than childcare centers Chalmers before he gets up to play 20 meters out queuing puts it on the toe he's got a kicking game as well and running back into the field to play with a try scorer Ralston and that will be half time he keeps playing he's played the whistle not the hooter anyway that's the end of the end of the first half 14 points to 6 in favour of St. James as they scored a try in the first two minutes. Extraordinary stuff whereby the footy went dead in goal. Then the line dropout didn't go 10, so they got a tap restart. And this man queuing, smashed his way, takes a meat pie, thank you very much. Then he decided to have another crack. This time he barges a, a little bit wider. If Faith hit back through Walston, good sweeping play. Uh, a lovely little short ball there from Gordon. Go no over and score. And then one more just before half time. Uh, and remember, when you go there, Struddies are your buddies. Struddies are your buddies. We'll take a break. 14 6 in favour of St. James over Faith Lutheran. We are, we are the home. We will make a difference in this world. We are. This is a city where the sun shines all year, where we sing when we're winning, and we play without fear. This city is a family, and families stick together. We've always been in it to win it. This city never says never. Waiting for the uh, Carnival Hooter to get things underway. 14 points to 6 in a crazy game of footy the first 20 minutes. Three tries to one. Conversions haven't been the greatest from either side. St. James from Brisbane and Faith Lutheran College will kick off from Painlands for the second half. We've seen comebacks before. We saw a beauty this morning. Still going the big fella. Rolls over and gets up as Belin Pua. Held says the referee. I don't know why I didn't hear that. Ambrose Kelly. He wants that further back. You've pinched a couple of metres. There we go. We're off. Ball back in underneath. But uh, Luke Cronin saw that happening. Shuts it down pretty quickly. QN goes himself again. He's got two. Turns it back inside. Probably could have gone all the way to himself. Gets the offload. Goes backwards. Keeping it alive here at St. James's. He'll straighten the play now with Button right. Oh, he's having a field day. He's Elijah Kewen. Bakalahi, the big fella, goes over and scores. Make sure I've got the right number. 
I thought Kewan would have another crack. A bit of push and shove at the back of the ruck. Goes over and scores to the big number eight and Bakalahi. It's their fourth try now, St. James's. Attention all teams playing the 140 time slot. That's the next time slot coming up. Uh, please, you guys need to go into the app for round two and press submit. Say that again. Those teams playing in the next time slot, that's 140. Uh, if they could go into the app to round two and print submit, or if you cannot do that, please contact John Thomas. Conversion is. Oh, it's hit the upright as well. Score remains 18 points to six. St. James's will receive again. Can they put some more hurt on the scoreboard? It's a long way to go, 18 minutes. Restart. Traps with his foot. Now he's sent the big end to the line. By Lane, a pearl with the, with the carry. Played on the 20. They do a tough face Lutheran College. Just up against some very, very big bodies from St. James's. Throws a dummy. Looking for a ball inside, doesn't do so. Got a play down in backfield, grabbing in his right shoulder. Don't know whether he felt awkwardly or not, but anyway, we'll stop and he's not laughing. He's a big boy. It's Riley Glass. He gets to his feet and he's done something to his left shoulder. He'll come to the sideline. He's not happy about it, but anyway. Plenty of footy left in the week. So just to be sure, they'll bring him to the sideline. Chuck some ice on that. Nielsen. Still going, Nielsen. Loses the footy, does he? No, play on. Just roar of the crowd for a well-executed tackle. Gordon. Gordon, the half-back. Motors up within 18 of the try line. So, Faith Lutheran College well, haven't given up yet. Cronin. The round, starting at they do need to score next. Faith Lutheran College. Kick into the end goal there. The chase is good. Scores the try. There's Kyle Gordon of his own kick. Southern Cross Catholic College on field two. Chanel College will play Chisholm Catholic College on field three. They hit back. Shallum College. Kick right in front of them. Within a converted try to lock it up. Sees nothing on. Puts a little toe in. Goes through and just slams it down. Try time. Patrick College Mackay. Play Saint right in front here should be easy enough for the halfback in Kyle Gordon to convert his own try. Play Saint John College to complete the 140 round of matches. He's going to kick off at 2.30. All Souls St. Gabriel's up against Aquinas. So choose to kick off at 2.30. Conversion to successful. I don't know how straight that was. We're at halfway, but anyway. 
18 12. Just 13 and a half minutes to go. That's gone out in the full as well. Penalty. Not for the first time, that's about the fourth. Kick that's gone over the sideline from a kickoff or a penalty in the middle of the park. Well, they're thinking about kicking for touch, which I can. Her trick sends that to the sideline. Yes, just 29 out from the from the try line. They hit back here. Could put the wobbles on St James's. Tap restart from the centre three quarter. Teresi. 15 to go. Wilkes. Looking for a quick play ball. Gets it. Da from dummy half. Away he goes. There is Leicester. And Leicester get close to the try line. The reason he took it, I don't think actually Gordon, the number seven, was ready. He's going to award the try, I think. No, he's lost it. Currently, uh, these are the teams that will be playing at 2.30, which is the next time slot. Aquinas College will play all souls. St. Gabriel's School on field one. Morris College, Shall Emerald, survive, St. James. Joseph's College, Toowoomba on field two. Ignatius Park College will play Marymount College on field three. And Padua College will play Emmaus College, Rockhampton on field four. Our Lady of the Southern Cross College will play St. Columban's College on reel five. And to round out the uh, two thirty oh, good uh, carry. On field six, we we'll see Holy Spirit College. Draws some attention from Hamish Wilkes. Play the ball, going wide and sideways. Penalty. He might have gone around his own player. He did an obstruction. Look promising there for a moment, but anyway, they've given up possession. Burns. Wilkes now to the centre and throw the winger and Hicks is coming to do some work. Throw him back onto the 30. Gordon. Nimble footed Gordon. Still going Gordon. Tries to get underneath Q and doesn't do so. He'll get up 12 out from the try line. They've got numbers to the right hand side. Hicks is with the footy. Hicks, Hicks trying to weave his way through there. He's going to be nigh there. Kieran's in his way. Ball and all tackle. Ten metres out. Colrain, the back rower, within a metre. Last tackle on the referee. Grubber kick in. Tidied up here at the boot laces. Gets the offload. Kieran's with it. Throwing it across the front of the goalpost. And it'll be Teresi to stop that play from the tackle. Again, Teresi. Ball pops out the back here. It's in the hands of Faith Lutheran's number nine and Mitchell Lester. Allowed to run. Lines, man, let's go! Oh, glass. Cut out balls. 12 and Coleraine within a metre. St. James is hanging on. Dar from dummy half. Just wait for the referee to award the try here. It's Kyle Gordon. He's got another try. And that is 18 16 with a kick to come eight and a half minutes to go. Wow.
Referee had a good look for a little while. I'm not sure what he's trying to look for, but anyway. Important kick. No extra point, no golden point, I should say. Or extra time. Doesn't seem in any hurry to kick this, but could turn around to bite you if you're looking for minutes on the back end and you're behind. So Joseph Hertrick. You pick out a spot to aim for, strikes it, comes back inside the right hand upright. So we've got a locked up ball game, 18 all. <coughs> Might be field goal yet. Yeah, I don't recall calling a game with a field goal confro in the four years. Six half six and a half minutes to go. Locked up, eighteen all. Into the sun, he's touched that, bats it back in, knocked back on two occasions, picked up in the end. Look out, something out of nothing. The chases were coming through. Put on his head is Kyle Gordon. That will be a penalty. Just momentum above the horizontal. There's no way they should be anywhere near that. It was, gonna be, it was touched twice backwards from the kickoff. <laughs> Oh, Gordon just goes for a bit of a run. Go, three minutes short of halfway. Oh, might have been a bit of a shoulder charge there. Didn't see too many arms involved, but anyway, get up and play it. Gordon, Cronin, Cronin going backwards, still going as Cronin, and it gets absolutely monstered, he's exposed, gets a big shot there from Bakalahi, Gordon again, finding ball runners, he finds one there in Williams Burns, going sideways, not making a lot of metres, they come to the blinds, a lot of traffic over here, realising that he goes back the other way, there's Cobb. Oh, Gordon. Crossfield kick. It's not the last. So the chase is coming through. It's allowed to bounce. Allowed to bounce. It's going to be tidied up. Has to bring it back into the field of play, and he does so. Gets the nine metres out. They'll use the big bodies to try and muscle their way out from their own try line. First one, that was Quark. Penalty. Inside the 10. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, the referee, well, it's 18 all. Both sides want to win this one. Referee will tap to one of the captains. Elijah Kuhn spoken to. Penalty will stay. It goes to St. James's. Three and a half minutes to go. Eight in all. Four tries to three. Plainland's obviously kicking better. 38 metres for a try or set up for a field goal. Good 
Good carry. Thinks about an offload. Loses the footy. First tackle. Coach killer. That'll be a scrum feed now. The plane lands. Faith Lutheran College. First tackle. Wow. So, a few of the backs are offside, but back in the scrum thing is a, a union scrum where you can be in line with the lock's feet. And in rugby league, you've got to be back 10 metres. Something out of nothing here coming from the wing of the left wing. And Walters. Cue on the tackle or over the top. Big hits. They keep coming. Williams Burns gets a couple. Ambrose Kelly, one of those. Now the winger wants to do some work, and it's Brody Hicks. Blindside, they want to go. Goose stepping is Ralston, or he has a try. Cole Gordon has a double out of the halves. The points so far. Hicks again. Under two minutes to go. Is there a field goal? Just looking where uh, Gordon is. Here he is. Puts a kick over the top. End over end, allowed to bounce. Now, 90 seconds, I fear a draw. Surprised he didn't go for a field goal. He was a long way back. Well, it goes dead and goal. They get him back from a line dropout. Cron on the tackler. The 30. Kewen, been dangerous all game, two tries so far. Held says the referee. <laughs> Bit of shenanigans there from Luke Cronin to the preciseness of the referees play the ball, suggesting he should go back a bit further. Last tackle, under a minute to go. Is there a whopping big field goal? No. Crossfield bomb. Taken there by Jacob Clark. 45 seconds remaining on the ground clock. And we've got to play down. And that will wind down the clock with 30 seconds to go. So he needs to get to his feet quickly. And he does. And that's good sportsmanship. He could have stayed down there, but he's going to hobble back in the line and give faith losing him. An opportunity, if you will, albeit there, 65 metres from the try line. Take the tackle. Last play. Well, heard a bit early. So we've got our first draw of the carnival on field number one, 18 all. St. James College from Brisbane over Faith Lutheran College at Plainlands. 18 all. So, yeah, got off to a fly. They flew out of the blocks in St. James with two early tries. As we've seen all day, anything can happen. We'll take a break here. What a game in rugby league. We've got the 2.30 game coming up. Aquinas are up against All Souls St. Gabriel's due to kick off at 2.30. 